Okay, it's time for our final Pacific Theater scenario. Operation Sunrise, July 1942. Okay, in this battle, we assume that the Japanese destroyed most of the US Pacific fleet at Pearl Harbor including the valuable carriers, and that the Japanese also finished off the remains of the American fleet when taking Hawaii. Realizing that the US would never surrender, Japan decides to go for an all-out invasion of the west coast. All this all, the Japanese cancel operation in the Solomons and Australia and take some 20 divisions out of China. Major landing would have most likely taken place in Southern California, but diversionary landings could have occurred in San Francisco. While it is unlikely they could have taken this city, it would have diverted US Army troops from Fort Ord, and the Presidio at the time was a major command center. The scenario is not true to scale and is merely for entertainment. Really. Yeah, okay, this is a Japanese invasion of continental United States. Uh, yeah, I'll definitely play the Japanese here. Crap. Okay. Oh, uh, this is an infantry gun. This is another one of those that you go next to the infantry unit and shoot. Half of the unit will destroy, will be, will die. And this is okay. So we have four of these better tanks. A platoon of four of the weaker tanks and a couple of infantry. Airplanes, a uh, very few shots on a artillery battery, 13, that's something like 3 turns at maximum. And we have a mortar. These are airplanes, the battle zero, I think they're all bad. Yeah, they're very small planes, very small payloads. We already see some of the enemy, some initial points here, so there's likely some kind of a unit or a gun there. Here, same here. I can't believe that these machine guns are only defense. This is a landing after all. We don't have that many units. And there are occasional flags within the city. Probably defended by infantry. Yeah, important buildings within the city. And important crossroads. This seems to be the main area where that we need to reach. And take over the bridge. Okay. It, it's fairly interesting. I'll actually set up the Apartment targets now. We'll start by targeting these buildings. Almost guaranteed to have infantry in them. And we don't have many shots with this good artillery battery, so let's make them count. Yeah. That fire is smoke. Uh, I don't think I should bombard the smoke. We could probably fire directly with the mortars. Same with the airplanes. Do I? Where do? We'll send them here and there. Not too much concern where I'm actually sending them. 
I will keep the buildings as targets. Okay. I want to smoke here. Ooh. 155 millimeter hobbiter. Yeah, those are the hobbiters that, you know, artillery battery level city uh, city buildings. A single shot. Oh yeah. Ooh, that was a good one. Yeah, we're losing mortars. Ooh. But I don't really care about the mortars, and not, not at all, so. But you know, I do care, and now it's too late. I care because. Ooh, there's another artillery there. Well, someone had to take the shots. I'm glad I didn't take them with the with the tanks. Um, ooh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Uh, someone has to take those shots. I don't want anyone to take them. We, I think it's better for us if we just charge. At least. Maybe this is gonna be hard, no matter what we are used at. Oh crap! Are again? I wanted to react. The reason I wanted to react because it might open up our. Well, open up a road for the next guy. And that gun is now lost. Doesn't matter what you do, no, won't matter at all. That gun is lost. Ah. We have a quite a lot of crew. Jesus Christ. Yeah, yeah, of course you're killing everyone. I'd say there's uh, at least a decent probability that here there are more of these guns. I'm thinking of putting up a smoke screen with these infantry units so we can move our tanks into this city and rest the troops with them in them without too much trouble. In many ways I think it's more important to maintain uh, functioning infantry in this mission. We have 25 standards of time, so it's not like we have to blindly rush with the tanks in order to make, to make it.
going to take a little visit here just to make sure there aren't actually any enemies here. Okay. Engineering squads. I don't want. But I do need to take this. There's a 155 millimeter howitzer there. It's going to annihilate infantry. Might even destroy tanks. I I just can't afford to let it be. There might be infantry there. <laughs> yeah, these crappier tanks that could go there. I don't want to reach the good tanks. Uh, I think we should move here. Uh, we in in a solid group. And the purpose is to take that and then move to here and these primary targets, and after that maybe even here. The other group will head south to take these buildings and move on here. If someone encounters trouble, the other groups will try to try to provide some support. Hey, let's see what they have in store for us. Nothing. There's something there. What is it? Uh, mortars are in no condition to fire. We don't have many tanks here, so hopefully we won't encounter many either. We do have two of these better tanks. Um, I think we'll be fairly con conservative in our moving forward. We can't simply rush here with three tanks and expect nothing bad to happen. Okay, first things first, we need to take a peek. to smoke yet. I want the infantry to get closer to the flag. It's very very unlikely that it's on the enemy. Okay, this should reveal a lot of a lot of enemies. Ooh, shit, they have tanks. Mobilized.
Ooh, a single rifle shot can take down our airplanes there. That's pretty weak. They do have uh, pretty nice tanks. I think we can get some something like four turns of shots from these batteries. They don't fire many times, only three shots per per artillery bombardment. It's not a lot. Okay, let's look at the situation. Major, major concentration of troops here. One of these uh, M7 priests. Okay, it was one of their artillery. It was damaged. Yeah, this will be a major confrontation. The steward is something that we don't have to worry about, meaning that it's comparable to our tanks as far as armoring and main weapon is concerned. Same with the lease. Uh, armoring is much better. But we have a proper chance against them. Yeah. They will... I will shoot at the target we're shooting now. <sighs> or do we... What's the point? Okay, cancel everything. This is a guaranteed concentration of hostiles. We'll prioritize it over possible targets. I'm not sure if the artillery does will do any good here. But this was a valuable contribution from the fighters. We located a major nest of hostile tanks. No. San Francisco police. So it seems that the major army units are located here. Most of them, we didn't locate anything interesting here. We didn't encounter a lot of anti-aircraft fire either, so I'm assuming more like police units, things like that. can't be helped. We do want to pick up the pace a little bit. And we didn't see anything. Dump the infantry here just to take a peek. So I'm expecting there to be at least a squad or two. How about before that? Probably nothing. Okay, what about here? We should be starting to encounter something. I should 
drive there with uh If they don't do anything this round, we'll definitely go for the flags. Okay, we don't want to lose these tanks, they're going to be veteran units. They are our best tanks anyway, so... They definitely have the Hobbitzers. That's not a battery, that's a Hobbitzer gun, so it means it will be somewhere on this map. Don't lose that tank. Uh, losing a few infantry isn't bad. I certainly don't want to lose uh, our few precious tanks. Uh, that was our command unit. That's, that's pretty bad. <laughs> okay, there it is. 155mm Hobbiter. So oh, we were basically entirely correct. Uh, although I do suspect that there's actually two of them there. What's a good way to take them out? San Francisco police. Look what police have a semi automatic rifle. Browning automatic rifle, rifle grenade, so very similar to a normal infantry unit, nothing special there. We need kills, we need to suppress it. Yeah. Hopefully something a little bit more. Try to get another kill. If we get that, we'll assault it directly. It's probably not the only infantry unit here, but it sort of um, blocks the way to the gun. We just can get rid of it. Things should open up a little bit. Oh, oh, bro. Horo is a big gun. Mm, Horo, I think you should drive there. I think you should target it. Ooh, that's beautiful. Now I think you should go away. Open away there. That's fine, we can... Press the gun a little bit. I'll save the shots in case we have to defend against them. Ooh, that's a good one. That is a good one because now we can do this. It won't survive it. Yeah, they ain't coming back. Ah, 
more importantly we it's now safe to move our main tanks here uh, infantry out only one of it are gone so that means there will be more somewhere <sighs> uh, I will try render yeah, I'm just wondering how should I actually attack here? Might even be that they're already on the move. I can't see them there anymore. They might be driving up here trying to retake these. Artillery was coming somewhere here. Let's see if it does any good. Uh, probably not. Destroyed a few of the buildings. Mm, but overall, very, very inconsequential. One shot left. Yeah, this will be our final shots with this artillery. This isn't a good way to attack. Trickling down. Trickling down. If we are going to reach some victory flag position, we'll probably stop for a turn to gather up this, this trickle of troops. Otherwise, ooh. we do have to be careful. It seems like they're trying to. Maybe even move up to those victory flags. And I probably was here. The toughest fight will be had between the tank groups, and I think at that fight we'll have to leverage some good use out of our infantry, because I think we that's where we have an upper hand. We don't have a lot of ammunition on these tanks. This won't hamper our anti-tank capabilities in any way. But we just have to be mindful of that. We don't have the ammunition. 
we can't rely on our tanks to clear out the infantry. That's what I'm saying. We have something like 20 shots per tank. So even though you can do a lot with that, it's not enough to fight this entire map. It also doesn't mean that we're going to save them up or anything. It just means that we have to prepare for the fact that fighting against the infantry will should be mostly done with the infantry. We do need to take control of this hill. Probably one of the better locations to fire anywhere near here. Also need to think a little bit how to use those good tanks of ours. They're only good because they have a gun that is capable of destroying enemy tanks. They aren't good because they can take shots. So what it means is that in an optimal case we would Every, some, every other units would take the enemy shots first, so the bleed, bleed them try of shots, and then these guys come in preferably at point blank range and just blast the enemy unit away. Because that's something that it's very hard to do with our infantry, and probably even the weaker tanks. So we are not interested in some kind of a fair fight tank duels. We Treat them mainly as mobile artillery and tank artillery. They're not meant to go toe to toe with enemy tanks. They basically have the weapon to finish off tanks. Hmm. Do, 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 do. In calendar. Um, I'll try to crash a few of these buildings. Mm, that's going to be it. After that, we don't have any more ammunition. Again, speed is of importance. We don't have a extremely tight sort of a deadline where we need to clear things up. But six turns have already passed. It'll take probably another s uh, around turn 50 before we enter the final battle, battle areas. We have uh, enough time. So hmm. we have to be somewhat careful. We've seen enemy infantry groups. Enemy infantry groups try to come back and retake things. There is another might already be abandoned for all we know.
not sure what to do with the artillery. I mean, mortar artillery. Ah, okay. Ooh. Where to go next? Should start seeing enemy tanks from somewhere around here. No, not quite there even. <laughs> this is interesting. No, don't go there, you piece of crap. I want to give the infantry time to move to the forefront. What do you see? See anything? Yo ho ho ho. Okay. I'm intrigued to find out what's going to happen next. Anything could happen. So, oh, let's find out. Ooh, yeah, they're coming from all sides. Ooh. Flamethrower, destroy. Flamethrower, destroy. Immobilized. Well, that's good enough, actually. Yeah, we lost the uh, infantry squad and traded it for our uh, tank kill, basically. So, not a bad trade. This unit is not capable of uh, assaulting it. But we have units that are. We have at least four squads. Want you move in? See what's going on here. Not much is going on. We do want to attack with the infantry before going there with the tanks. For God's sakes. Not like I expected much from them. So go in, take a shot. Come That's how you do it. Um, I'm actually thinking of leaving a unit behind because there's those. 
random enemy infantry squads walking about. Okay, which one of you heroes gets to go back? Hmm, mm, E1. That's heavily injured squad. Still in operational condition, but lost basically half of the unit strength already. Not gonna be much of a loss if, if we send him back. Okay, and now the final bombardment. It shouldn't do anything to the enemy, maybe crush the building or two. And that's all I wanted it to do. Check the artillery situation. Draw the ammunition. I think. One of the squads we encountered up north left here some time ago. So now we should proceed east. What is it? Take a look before you die, you bastard. Ooh, three anti-air machine guns. This is why you exist. So we can quickly and without too much hassle get rid of these. Okay, we see something. Apparently, we might see something here. 
Not an, not quite the same. Ah. Okay, but glad to see our tanks are actually quite good. Or good enough in the sense that we don't have to... Once they get their shots, we can be fairly certain that they'll get some kills. US rifle squad moving in fast. So they are definitely trying to do something to regain areas. Fire another. Uh, machine gun destroyed. Single late. Okay. And nothing happens. Okay, I'm not going to fire anything anymore. It's over. Speed fights are always interesting. These are one of the few combat types where you can pretty much go all in free and have a good chance of actually pulling out a victory. We saw an infantry unit moving this way, so we need to go and cut it off. I want to kill it before it's in the middle of the city somewhere and I have no idea where it is. We do have the infantry unit inside, so even if we get assaulted, 
We'll probably do a reaction fire. What about you? How many shots do you have? 30, yeah, we can shoot fairly at all, every opportunity. Chance to heat is actually pretty low, but the gun is insanely large. Things should go fairly smoothly until we encounter the enemy tanks. Ooh. Ooh, Stuart destroyed. Where the hell did that come from? A tank in our rear. A game tank. I'm just incredibly lucky that we actually managed to destroy them. Yeah. Wait. Yeah, where the hell did they come from? Oh crap, they're so... All of their tanks have... are assaulting. It... Okay, this is uh, much worse than I thought. We need to keep this guy in a... not suppressed. Oh, thank god, luckily it's a engineering unit, otherwise... It would have had no chance. That is interesting. I'm sending this after it just to have a spotter here. Oh, there's infantry being here too. Oh shit. Pulling back a little bit. Yeah, it can't be this guy. This is our command unit. That can't be the guy who's left behind. We have engineers. Okay, someone at least stays with the command unit or close to it at all times. There's no telling how many of these infantry unit and tanks are running around here. We sort of missed each other. Mm -hmm. So then, should I send troops north to encounter those? Thanks, or should I just proceed with the plan? We can reposition these tanks fairly quickly. I think I'll prefer to go tank hunting with these. We can't really rely on a single squad of engineers to be able to keep keep things together for long. It was fairly lucky that it managed to destroy those two tanks. Oh shit, and it's not the only one. Only thing that's moving here. Yeah, we need to engage these immediately with everything we have. And there's more incoming. Okay, that should be enough of casualties. We can de defend our locations of victory flags with the single squad left behind. If there's not going to be a mass of full, fully full condition of squad squads incoming.
us taking our soldiers, our veterans. Uh, Japanese veterans, so that's gonna be a tough nut to crack. That really is... They're always capable of performing and... <laughs> we won't give them won't give them a chance to retaliate, at least not easily. I think we'll still proceed with a couple of tanks. Just because some of them came off doesn't mean all of them did. I'll also send one of the bitter tanks here and an infantry gun. So it's a solid, solid group of uh, enemies there. Actually, I'll send both of the infantry guns. I don't see them being all that great against tanks, but I will be sending the better tank here. We need to do something about these tanks running all over the place. We lost one squad basically there. We seem to be going for the middle of the map, north, northern flag, yeah. Hey there. You can keep company. Yeah, this is, seems to be their target. This guy is too suppressed to be able to function properly anymore, but we'll have to try to assault. Could we try flamethrowing? Just flamethrowing, that would be good enough for me. No, we have to assault. We should have the ammunition, but we're not doing I guess, because we're too suppressed, basically. So we don't have the courage needed to do a proper assault that has a chance to destroy the tank. Mm -hmm. That's lost. Same with this one. I do need to locate the hostiles. Did it try from here to here? That's that should be doable. Yes. And we are coming to the rescue. I think we'll do the same thing with this. The infantry will just fight every target we basically encounter. Okay, the tank group will move. Oh, go there. Tank group will move. Here. Move here, drop the infantry, which was a mistake apparently.
both you are shooting smoke there. It seems there's only remnants of infantry squads here. So, not too impressed. I guess they fail to mount a proper assault. That's the only thing they'll ever do now. US Marine, stop machine gun squad. That might be a leader unit. Let's try the infantry tank here. It'll destroy the building. Everything's moved. No. Ah, okay. Let's proceed. We're not gonna go up there with more tanks. Seems like we've in destroyed more of the most of the tank threat there. There might be a couple of tanks there, but not a huge amount. San Francisco citizen. Yeah, they'll destroy the, our engineers. Ooh, that's good. That is very good. To go there. Okay, okay there's another... Well, naturally there's another Lee, but... Sort of hoping that we would already deal with that. Let's route it so we can destroy it. Destroy it. Come on. Destroy it. Okay, this is going to be a little bit of a problem. Uh, destroy it. All fails. Uh. Okay, we definitely could use something more here. We might not lose, but we're not guaranteed to win either. And if we'll wait, it'll just come harder and more time consuming to move the needed troops there. That marine squad is basically done for. Actually, shoot the other group now. Before someone pops a smoke grenade here.
prepare other supplies. It's a bit risky to waste your ammunition like this or shots like this. Ammunition certainly isn't uh, much of a concern, but the shots are. This mission, I think, is probably quite interesting, uh, no matter which shot you play. It's mainly because uh, it's... Because... Uh, the Americans don't have their top, top armor units here. They have a little bit of the older stuff. Okay. Now I see anti tank guns on those trucks. Of course. We'll try to get them to fire a few more times. It'll make sure the tanks we sent to destroy them aren't gonna get shot. Or are less likely at least to be destroyed. Okay, that gun is out of action already. Probably that one too. Right, another full group of enemies. Hello. Closer, I need to get rid of these guns. I didn't want to shoot that. Kill the gun. That's the spirit. Things considering this went fairly well. Our biggest problem here are now these straggler units we can find all over the place. This battle probably is the toughest one we yet, yet lay, left here. Everything else is more or less being decided. There might be some fighting, but all the top heavy lifting has basically been done. You're going north. You're. I thought this was unnecessary, but it's not. Yeah, this won't last 25 turns. Definitely not, unless they have a lot of tanks or something like that in reserve somewhere. I don't see them having it. Decision, tension, position. So, everyone's staying in their positions then. That's just fine with me. Oosh. 
Okay, it's routed, it's not a threat. Nothing really working for us. But at least now we have some troop troops converging on that position. So we can just hold the alt for oh, a few turns. Things should turn around for us. So it's not like our situation is bad or anything. There's just a clean up job anymore. Okay, we can drive there with that. We drive there with this. Oh. Oh. Okay, that's pretty much it. Suddenly, enemy troops. Okay, it's the two Lee tanks that are basically our only problem at the moment. We have a couple of flags left captured. This fight will go on for something like two to three turns. I'm not sure about the fighting. Yeah. Continue firing. It's gone. Now they abandoned it. And the crew is much easier to kill, so I'm not going And no one's moving. Careful. We're going to swarm that with the infantry and after that we'll move in the tanks to finish it off. Enemy troops here are still left. San Francisco police. Police. How do we take care of the police?
Oh, life isn't going to be a um, problem. Ooh, more infantry. Ooh, we need more swarm their airplanes. That yeah, doesn't matter at all. Francisco's is it? Uh, this is uh, in a good position. We uh, shoot at the citizens. Okay, they're not gonna be a problem anymore. They never were, so... What we need to do now is attack that Lee with totally worthless units to get it to react. Or surprise. Never worked. All good. We also want to get rid of these. Flame tower. Destroy. Beautiful. Beautiful. Mm, just making sure that there isn't anything here anymore. So, move. Go here, here, dump infantry. Ooh, a lot of police. I definitely underestimated the defenses here, but I don't think it'll make much of a difference. I should have taken that flag. Come and support me. We definitely need additional troops here. We'll go fast track the rest of the mission. It's been decided so. There's no point trying to remove every single unit just because we might get a little bit of an advantage from it. Ooh, they have a lot of more squads here though. So we might do something. But I don't think so though. They're shooting quite a lot. Their capabilities react, 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 if anything is probably very limited. Oh, for God's sakes, die already. Oh, more soldiers. A different squad of soldiers again. So, there are quite a lot of police squads here. Or is it one of. It was probably one of that was in here. What? At least you can shoot once. And that's all we really needed. No, oh, that wasn't all we needed. But it's good enough. Okay, how far did you plan on pulling back? Oh, okay. Let's 
stuff. Mm, this should be over. It's this or the next turn that will be the last. I mean, 17th or the 18th. We probably get all the flags on the 17th. There might be a few units still left on the until the 18th. We can see. The game might rebel decide that wants to keep things going. But I think this is it. We need to locate the Ah, uh, no matter, this should be the end. This is uh, okay mission. A uh, city fight against it. the United States. Although the tanks were a bit too old. Could have been a bit more modern after all. We probably destroyed most of them with flamethrowers. Yeah, Japanese 1334, US Army 76. Decisive victory, yeah, no, and no case, no. But I still think the imaginary fights have been somewhat disappointing on the overall. This was probably the best one of them. But this is also the end of Pacific scenario, so we can move on to the Eastern Front or European Theater. European Theater is probably the correct way to say. Because it'll include... No, it, it'll include Europe, Eastern Europe, Africa, probably that area. Right from the start of the war, from the end, and it'll be something like 60 scenarios. So we'll go from units riding on horseback to modern tanks of the World War II. Ah, looking forward to it, it's probably also a lot of uh, mixed bag missions. But that's something for another time.